Hey everybody, uh, hopefully you've already seen our initial video on the Little Giant trailer by Let's Go Arrow, um, where we just talked about its attributes um, and why I chose this to test and to then project as what will hopefully be our ultimate um, backcountry exploration trailer. And in that video, if you haven't seen that video, you know, go down here in the show more section, I think, and there'll be a link so you can see that. Because um, it talks about, um, you know, the size, the weight, the payload. In that video, I talked about um, that the trailer can come to you delivered as a kit form to your door. And um, that it was a great thing to assemble uh, because it's, it's so easy to assemble and it's all clean work and everything that you need is right there. You just need a few hand tools to finish the job. Um, really, really great instructions. Um, I, I was just amazed because they take you through every step, you know, step one, step two. And what is really amazing is that with each step you have a sealed bag of the nuts, bolts, uh, machine screws, whatever it's going to take to do that step. So I know a lot of projects I do, you know, you get packages of bolts, you lay them down there, and then they say, well, we need a millimeter by millimeter. And I'm going, wow, my goodness, is that the 35 millimeter? Or is that the 30 millimeter? Or is that the 6 millimeter? Well, you know, it can be really confusing. So this makes it really easy to do. Great instructions, great, including how great it is to have all those bolts and nuts and all the um, things that you'll use for the assembly packaged in each step. That's a great thing. Now, you know, as I said, it just comes delivered, you know, in a trucking, by a trucking company. It's not a UPS delivery. It's a trucking company that brings this to you, you know, boom, on a pallet. Uh, so you got to be prepared for that. But once you get it, you can unpackage it, lay all the parts out, take a look at it, and basically the first thing you're going to do is lay out the main frame rails. Um, lay out the main frame rails and then lay the, we'll call it that, you know, the A portion that goes up for the tongue, lay that out and start bolting it together. Once you get that loosely bolted together, then you're going to attach the torsion bar axle to it. Now you've got the, the axle, the main framework all put together, and then by that time it's time to go ahead and put the wheels on it. Now you can get it jacked up, put the wheels on it, you've got it sitting up where it could be. Now, in our case, we also put the uh, tongue jack on it so that then we could get it set level and easily work on it. From that, that you know, stage, you can start putting the electrical wiring through the main tube. You can start putting the, the actual hitch tongue piece on it, the safety chains on it. Um, then you start to put the uh, all these U braces on it, the, the, the frame rails that's going to hold the sides and the floor in. And again, you can just put them on loose to start with, put them all on, and then from the time you do that, then you can start putting in the uh, galvanized panels that go on the floor and the sides of the trailer. Uh, the tailgates, front and rear tailgates, come assembled. All you then have to do is put the hardware on it that the attaches the gates to it and some weather stripping. And uh, by that time, it's looking like a trailer. And then all you have to do is finish it up with the, the lights, the side marker lights, the tail lights, the license plate bracket, and that, and you're good to go. Now, for me, this took, I probably spent a couple days of leisure time, only because, as you could tell, I was taking pictures all along the way. Um, but again, there was no area that I came across on the assembly of this trailer that made me stop and go, I, I don't know what to do here. You know, I'm, I'm lost. I don't, I don't understand it. It all just went together just fine and dandy. So uh, this is something I would not be afraid of. Like I've said before, you know, <laughs> if I can do it, you can probably do it. Um, so the next step, now that we've walked through the assembly, um, we are going to finish because we also have uh, the tent to put on it. We have the tarp to put on it. And then we're going to take the trailer out and start putting it through its paces. Um, see how it hauls an ATV. See how it hauls wood. See how that tent works when we go camping. And we're going to get all that done. Then we're going to bring it back in here. And then we're going to move on to modifying it with our more appropriate 
bigger off-road tires and then we'll start putting whatever gas packs, fuel packs, fare, or you know, whatever we figure out that we're going to do to make this the ultimate backcountry exploration trailer. So uh, stay tuned for those videos. And like I said, if you haven't seen that video, um, it'll show on the, show more here. You know, and you can see the links to, to the other videos. Um, and you can always visit our website to see a list of the videos that we have, all categorized. If you want to go back and look at other, you know projects we've got, our tests we've done. Um, so it's all there. Um, I'll see you in the next video. Until then, God bless.